there is a ladybug on this lamp. Good morning everyone and welcome to Saturday. It is extremely cold out today. I don't even know what temperature it is right now, but when Giselle left for work it was around 10 degrees out. The moment it's 20 it's supposed to stay a steady 20 or under throughout the entire day. And I don't think tomorrow's going to be much better. Nope. Tomorrow's not going to be much better, which is just lovely, and it's very windy as well, so we can feel the wind coming into the windows and everything. So it was very difficult to get out of bed this morning. Giselle was not late for work, thankfully, but we were having a very hard time getting out of the bed, which was only warm because we had been in it all night. And uh, yeah, I, I did get up with her because I knew if I didn't, then I would not want to get up for at least a few more hours. So I got up and I've been doing stuff. I'm currently working on picking up the kitchen, cleaning up the kitchen. Uh, the past few days, we haven't really been paying attention to the dishes, so I'm doing them right now. And uh, they're kind of, it's kind of keeping me warm a little bit because the, the water is so warm. Like our water gets scorching hot no matter how cold it is outside when it's, when the hot water's on. So that's good at least, and that's keeping me a little bit warm. But as soon as I was done, it started making me cold again. I went out and just checked the mail because I'm expecting a package, but it hasn't come yet. So I'll be waiting until next week, but uh, I'm hungry. I might eat some of these leftover waffles that we had from yesterday. And I have, I have a steady list of things to do all throughout the day. Uh, I like actually have separated into how much hours I'm gonna, how many hours I'm gonna allow myself to do things today. I'm going to allow myself like an hour more to clean up, to finish cleaning up the kitchen. And hopefully I can get it all done within in that time. I think I'll, I don't think I won't even need that much time. But I originally gave myself a certain amount of time to clean up. And then I'm going to give myself a certain amount of time to read. And then a certain amount of time to work on some reviews that I want to post over the next couple days. And uh, a certain amount of time to edit vlogs. Those are finally going to go up today. Uh, they're finally going to say I'm going to spend like six hours on vlogs today. We'll see how many that that allows me to finish and put up. And then I'm going to allow myself some more time to read later. So, as always, it's going to be a very busy day for me. I uh, just will be back from work uh, sometime early afternoon. And I didn't allow myself any before I didn't realize it while I was kind of scheduling it out in my head. Uh, that b before that I was not allowing myself some time to work on the bookshelf tour at all but I might uh, put some time into that as well if I can. Uh, I'll have to wait until Giselle gets home and then maybe we can do some bits of, I mean we can do the kitchen, the kitchen shelves, which will probably be a really good idea to get out of the way. And then all that's left will be to finish just a couple more shelves in my office. I still haven't done the key, Stephen King shelf in my office. Uh, so I'm gonna do the Stephen King shelf at some point. And then our bedroom, which does need, does need organizing still. Uh, we just haven't felt like doing it yet, but we will. So Giselle is home, and look what we're doing. <laughs> this is the perpetrator to most of the, the cold problems that we have in this apartment, is this one window. You can see it, the, the wind blowing through it, and uh, kind of pushing it out a bit. And hopefully, over time, this will allow it to be a little bit less cold in here. A little bit. It's still going to be really cold, though. It's. Cold. I mean, this is really the window that does the whole thing. Like, that window is perfectly fine. You, you feel your hand up to it, it doesn't let anything in. I mean, the whole yeah. house is still going to be freezing cold, but hopefully less drafty. Well, this will help the heat battle the coldness Our more. Our bedroom is still going to be freezing, though. I don't know if I can sleep in there tonight. Like We'll see. <laughs> so cold this morning when I woke up, and then when I went to work, it was really, really windy, and with the wind chill, it was minus 10 degrees yeah. outside, so... It's not so great. Oh, look at that. It's, it's fluttering. Oh, and this is not the only thing we did. <laughs> We've also hung this up. You can kind of see it. It should be flat, but the wind was blowing it. Hopefully it's not going to blow so much more now. But this blanket is covering this doorway. Because this room is the warmest room in the house, for sure. We've said that before. And this is going to help insulate it a bit to keep it that way. So I'm still going to be in my office working on stuff a lot. I'll just take... The, we have lots of blankets, thankfully. I'll take this blanket with me. Giselle has our our comforter that we put on our bed usually uh, that is always on our bed and yeah so I, I have to go into my office and work on stuff very soon but for now I guess we'll both just be in here doing whatever Re I'm gonna read and I guess she'll do what are you gonna do probably play my 3ds while I like listen to or watch something on my phone fun stuff also I spoke too soon earlier 
and about a package not coming, although it's not the package that I was hoping would come. I have no idea what this one is though, so I guess we'll find out together. It says it's from Penguin Random House, which does, doesn't really mean a whole lot. It could be a, a lot of different imprints, but it is what I thought it might be, I think. I see yellow. It is. It's exactly what I told Giselle it might be. I was thinking it was from Del Rey, and I was right. And it is the finished copy of something that I've already gotten. And I'm very glad that they sent it to me because I don't like the art copy very much. And it is Waking Gods. So a finished copy of Waking Gods. This... This uh, dust jacket is super off-centered. Like, super off-centered. But that's fine. It's not a big deal. Uh, I'm just really glad that I have the finished copy. Uh, so that I can go with my finished copy of Sleeping Giants. And the inside has this really cool cover like that again, of course. And yeah, so it's a sequel to Sleep Sleeping Giants, which I did a review on last year. And I'll be doing a review of this one this year. It comes out April 4th. It's about giant robots being buried in pieces all over the world and people having to find them. So, fun stuff. A little bit, little bit uh, anticlimactic in the first one. Hoping this one will make it more exciting. So, several hours later, I've gotten quite a bit done tonight, but not as much as I would like to, but then again, it's not uh, time for bed yet. I don't really feel tired, and it's still it's still kind of early, except I kind of have to think ahead to the fact that we're, we're going to be losing an hour of sleep tonight, <laughs> and I, some part of me is happy about that because it, the sun's going to start coming out later, but as of right now, present me right now is not too happy about it. But uh, it's not too big of a deal, and I have done a couple vlogs. Uh, I did not give myself as much time as I would hope to on, on it because I did. <laughs> I kind of fell asleep a little bit earlier, and then my head just kind of started hurting, and I didn't really feel like doing much of anything, especially reading and uh, like looking at just words on a page was making my head hurt. And uh, editing vlogs didn't sound too appealing, so I was just kind of sitting playing Minecraft for a little while, and that was obviously not scheduled in my plan of things to do. I, I, did, I did lots of stuff, but yeah, not quite the day I was hoping for, but then again, the day is not over, like I said, so uh, one of my night is going to be, for the rest of the night, is just editing more vlogs and hoping to post them tomorrow, finally, and we'll see how many I, I decide to post, and uh, it's, it's still very, very cold outside, it's getting colder and colder, except for uh, Giselle is currently still in the living room. She's probably gonna stay in there all night. She's probably even fallen asleep just because it's so nice in there. Once you when you walk in from the kitchen to the living room, uh, once you pass through the blanket, it is unbelievable the change. It's crazy how nice how much nicer it is in the living room than it is in the kitchen. And this room's okay, but I have this like blanket on me, so it's it's not too bad with that. But anyway, uh, it's gonna be really cold tomorrow, and then uh, apparently there's like some sort of really bad winter storm happening sometime in the next couple of days like lots of snow and lots of cold so hopefully well maybe you never know I might get a day off from work because of snow which will be nice to catch up on some things and we'll see but I think that's it for today I, I don't wanna say for sure how much longer I'll be up and doing stuff, but I'm definitely going to be up and doing stuff for a little while. So, thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you tomorrow.